Uh, why? Everyone loves movies. I love movies. You probably love movies. Movies are the best. I can't tell you how much I adore old classics like Total Recall, Robocop, The Thing, Aliens. But you know what I don't adore? The f***ing pointless, heartless, soulless Hollywood remakes of these classic movies that are perfectly fine as they are to begin with. Now, remakes are not exactly a new thing Hollywood has been doing. I mean, movies like The Thing or The Departed are both actually remakes. Although recently, the attitude towards remakes of beloved properties has become more and more just money-grabbing and greedy. I understand that these companies want to milk as much as possible from anything the general audience could recognize. Ooh, I know what a Robocop is! But when you remake Psycho with Vince Vaughn as the lead role, something has gone horribly, horribly wrong. I can see a case for a remake when it's of a foreign movie. That makes a little more sense to me, like the girl with the dragon tattoo we make. While not particularly necessary, it does make sense on a financial level, because people don't like to have to read when watching a movie. Am I right? Kill yourself, you're just jealous. Now, there's nothing wrong with remaking a movie in theory, but then what's the point if you have no real artistic vision or purpose of your own? Because just about all of these modern remakes are literal retellings, hitting every single beat of the original movies, but toned down to PG-13 so they can profit from the most general audience imaginable. And this, in essence, is why the previously mentioned The Thing and The Departed work so well. They have a reason to exist, they're not just the same as the original. Their respective directors added something special and interesting to warrant their existence. And then there's something like 2010's Clash of the Titans. A lifeless, made-by-committee bore fest with absolutely no creativity or flair, created only to bank on the people who say, Ooh, I remember what a Clash of the Titans is! I've always thought it would make a lot more sense to take things that were totally awful in the first place and remake them to make them good. Because one of the biggest problems of remaking classics that endless people have passionate nostalgia for is that you have impossible standards to live up to. Did anyone really think Robocop 2014 was going to be a satirical look at American culture with great action and mega violence like the original? Of course not, because that would mean writing something that would be taking just a smidgen of a risk. In the case of Robocop, they could have made a remake work. It's not impossible. It would have been great if they acknowledged the fact they were shamelessly remaking it within the movie itself, like the satirical look of the original. I'd buy that for a dollar. That could have made it at least somewhat memorable. But this, this has already been and gone. No one will remember Robocop 2014 in a year's time. Hell, even in a day's time. Hell, even 10 minutes after seeing it. Now and again, it might be mentioned in passing like, Hey, do you remember they remade Robocop that one time? Yeah. On a quick side note, can someone please explain to me the difference between the idea of a remake and a reboot? Not that I particularly give a sh** but I'm waiting for that comment that says, Hey, just so you know, you f***ing retard, Robocop 2014 is not a remake, it's a reboot. Your videos are such shit, kill yourself. As far as I understand, something like Robocop 2014 is kind of both, isn't it? It's a reboot because it's re-establishing the character and setting and shares the same name without being a prequel or sequel, but at the same time, it's also a remake because it's telling the same story. Right? Right? Oh, f*** it. Who wants to watch The Day the Earth Stood Still with Keanu Reeves? <sighs> How long is it going to be until we see a remake or reboot of Starship Troopers, Die Hard, Indiana Jones, Aliens, The Big Lebowski, Blade Runner, Fight Club? Or how much time is it going to be until they reboot something like Lord of the Rings? Just to milk the teats of the movie cow a little more. The scariest part is it's not even out of the realm of plausibility. Just look at that f***. God awful Spider Man movie they sh out only five years after Spider Man 3. It's fing atrocious. So, in the end, I'm kind of in two minds. It's perfectly easy to just ignore these stupid remakes because the originals will always be there for you to enjoy. But at the same time, come on, Hollywood. What the f? What the f? It's not like we've told every possible story ever. 
It's not like we have to really reach to find good ideas for movies. Oh. So last episode I asked which pop star or music doer person you think is the worst or whatever. And here are my favourite answers. Nicki Minaj is the worst. She looks like Lady Gaga, Gaga transformed into a Barbie doll and sounds like she's having an epileptic fit whenever she opens her mouth. Katy Perry. F*** Katy Perry. My air conditioner sings better than her. Coldplay is the worst. Nicki Minaj because she looks like Jinx from Pokemon. I would rather watch an anus opening and closing really fast than Nicki Minaj's dumb f***ing face hole. All of them! So this episode's question. What movie would make you the most angry if Hollywood remade it? For me it would be Lord of the Rings, I guess. After The Hobbit's done, if they're just like, f*** it, let's just reboot it. Tell me in the comments below for a chance to be featured at the end of the next episode. So that is what I thought about shitty Hollywood remakes. Remember to tell me what you think, and as always, thanks for watching. All comments and ratings are appreciated. I'll see you next time. Bye. Bangkok Dangerous Carry, Clash of the Titans, Conan the Barbarian, The Crazies, Day of the Dead, The Day the Earth is Still, Death Race, Don't Be Afraid, The Dark, Flubber, The Fog, Footloose, Friday the 13th, Fright Night, Fun with Dick and Jane, The Grudge, Halloween, The Hills Have Eyes, The Invasion, The Italian Job, The Karate Kid, The Lady Killers, The Last House on the Left, The Mechanic, Night of the Living, Dead 3D, Old oh Boy, Planet of the Apes, Psycho, Quarantine, Red Dawn, The Shaggy Dog, Times 2, The Texas, Chainsaw Massacre, The Time Machine, Total Recall, The Amazing Spider-Man, F*** you.